What's up everyone, it's your one and only OCG coming at you with a brand new episode of Mafia uh, This is Mafia, uh, what's it called? Mafia Definitive Edition guys, welcome back uh, My name is Ops and we are starting a walkthrough gameplay part 1 guys uh, Before we start this I want to just quickly give you a little clip of a sponsor that I got for Hero Mask So check it out and I'll be right with you. Let me quick thank Hero Mask for sending me one of the products. I am really thankful to them. Uh, they sent me a Hero Mask VR uh, goggles. Really nice, handy little piece of work. Uh, I have played some games on it. I downloaded it on my Play Store and I played some uh, VR games. That's pretty cool, guys. If you guys are interested into this, make sure to check it out the description. And uh, there's going to be a link down below. Uh, uh, to tell you more about this little product, uh, you can play different type of VR games on your phone. You can have educational games uh, for your for kids or anyone. Uh, this they can be, for instance, uh, learning new new language like uh, Spanish or something, and you have to press different numbers in Spanish or whatever. It's really cool and handy, guys. If you enjoy it, check it out. And yep, yeah, so thank you so much once again, Hero Mask, for sending me your product. Alright guys, so uh, thanks so much for spending some time on that. Uh, if you guys are still interested in today's, make sure to check out the description below. And we're gonna go for, for a new game. Uh, let's go. Medium. And we're gonna go on uh, look at vision off, everything off, and let's get cracking.
You're Tommy? Thomas Angelo, Detective Norman. You alone? <laughs> no self-respecting badges coming in here unless it's the health inspector. What can I get you? Ah, just the coffee. Thanks. Dip your beak. No, thanks. Suit yourself. So, you yeah. said on the phone you might have a proposition for me. That's right. Well, if you're looking to set up a gravy train, you called the wrong cop. I'm not looking for any uh, associates. Good. Because I'm on the nut. Can't even pay for the coffee. But I got plenty to trade. Well, let's hear it. How long you been in town? Three years. Caught my teeth in Empire Bay. Well, they handed you the Morello case. Right out of the gate. That's what the paper says, ain't it? And what's it to you? Tough break. The case must be getting pretty cold by now. Or you got something might warm it up. Yeah, I might have some. And what's my end of the deal? Uh, you want money? Some sort of immunity? None of that. I got people I need to protect. Ah, families. Always the Achilles heel, ain't it? So who you got? A sick ma or a wife and a litter of kids? Wife and daughter. And no one else to watch your back, I'm guessing. Wouldn't be here otherwise. Pity that. Pa always said a man needs friends if he's going to survive in this world. Yeah. Well, in my world, it's the other way around. No surprise there. Look, I can't promise anything for your family, not until I hear what you're trading. So, are you talking? Or are you just killing time before they come for you? You think I'm on the run? <laughs> oh, I know it, Tommy. Jesus, look at you. Surely gassed. You haven't slept for days. Your neck's got to be aching from all that looking over your shoulder you're doing. No, the way I figure it is you got someone powerful mean on your tail and they ain't giving up until you end up in the river. And you walk out that door without me, we both know you're not making it five steps. Boss. Yeah, you stick around, you tell me your story and... Maybe you got a shot at living long enough to walk that girl of yours down the aisle. Either way, it looks like I'm buying you a cup of coffee. Christ, I don't know how everything got so balled up. No one ever sees the hair pen until it's too late. But you didn't get handed a heater in the nursery, did you? No. I was a cab driver back in 30. Story time, everyone. Story time. An offer you can't refuse. Let's go. Don't worry, I guys. I'm still here, okay? Because the money was better. It was at the end of one of those shifts. When I first met Polly and Sam. Oh, shit! First time you said Polly, I thought that was a female name. No offense. Put him like hello. Fast. Let's go, man. Come on, Tommy. Let's do it. I got a gun point well, I have to press all one because my R2 is funky. Funky donkey booby dot com, guys. Let's trouble. go. Well, you got trouble. Drive. How the hell they know we'd be there? It doesn't matter now. We just gotta lose them. Uh, how many cars we got following? One for now, but there'll be more. Hold tight. I'm gonna try some. Wow, those guys. Sick. You don't get to ask questions. 
We need to get over the river. Take the Giuliani Bridge. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. Giuliani Bridge. Delay oh, I like that they give me them. Give it's like hell. Time. When we're back, I'll wake up Crush. the top. So, oh, no, <laughs> you, know, okay. you know what this feels like? Just it feels the like the, the, the hey, controls of the car is like legit. either. All I'm doing is taking uh, you guys Legit like from a GTA so 4, you know? That. But I like it, it's very hard to to steer, to control the car, so I, I, it's like a challenge. You got a dead wish or something? Well, yeah, dude. You want me to go fast, okay, right? Okay, we're at the river. Where am I taking you once we're over the bridge? I'm getting tired out of questions. Ooh. Pressing L. Uh, L, what I'm thinking about. Pressing uh, arrow to the left. Allows you to change the... Uh, Cameras of a vehicle. I don't know which one you get to prefer. Ah, Just to ram other vehicles. I know some shortcuts that'll anyway. slow them down. I don't care how you do it. You shake them off. Speed. That was your shortcut. I lost him, didn't I? Not all of them. These guys really don't like you, do they? Sometimes business partners fall out. It happens. Quit I need to the Polly. More he knows, more chance of him not seeing the sun come up. I ain't heard a thing, fellas. <laughs> you left them in the dark. We ain't clear yet. Keep driving. Poor bastards digging the road for the works program aren't gonna thank us for this. Three crates down. How many motors were at the exchange? Four, five, maybe. I know with him, he's called for more. Sure feels like it. Next time, we take more muscle. We should have expected trouble. When the boss hears about this, there'll be hell to pay. Come on, we can do this. Oh, right, this guy's gone. Wow, he, he really didn't know how to drive. Like, come out. on. There's more and more of them. We're not gonna last long unless we're back on our own turf. Let's get back to the I ain't gonna lie, driving so hard. Thank you. Oh, we have to go through that bridge. Uh, thing, the bridge so. is up, ain't it? Yeah. We can make it. What the hell are we doing? Just sit tight and pray. Never done that <laughs> before. Me neither. Okay, so little Italy. Now, your night's not over. All right. I didn't see this coming. You think he squealed? I think you zip it tight. We talk it through back at the bar. Oh, nice. Oh, I ain't gonna lie, that was quite difficult. You got a death wish or that something? was still my first mission. Ooh. Okay, Chill. we're close. Oh, nice. Pull over in front of that bar. Celieri's place. Yeah, that's the one. Wait here. What for? You want a little something from the Don or not? Shit, we're gonna die? Nah, he's gonna give me something probably. Compensation for your services. 
any damage to your car. This makes us square. I'm sure it's more than enough. Good. Don Silieri wants you to know that he's very grateful. So if you ever need anything, maybe a loan, or some honest work, don't hesitate to ask. Don doesn't forget his friends. Yeah, okay, thanks. <sighs> One more thing. This matter stays between us. Anyone asked where you got that money? You wanted it at poker. The scratches on your car. You swerved. To keep from. Hey, what about the bullets? <laughs> you got it. No, of course. Yeah, but we, we, it's true. We nearly killed that little poor lady over there. I could have had a heart attack. Enough to fix the cap. <laughs> Nearly enough to buy a new one. I thought about what Sam said about work. I wasn't interested. The money was good, sure, but I didn't want to get in with criminals. Better to be poor and alive than rich and dead. So, right there, back then, I was out. Well. You know, personally, if I had the opportunity like this, money, money, money. I don't know. Okay, so here, guys, you will be getting a trophy. You'll be unlocking a trophy. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not. It doesn't pop up for me right now because uh, I have already done this mission. I'm sorry, guys. Yes, I know. I know. Uh, but that's it. So let's go. Let's go. Don't judge me, guys. Don't judge me. Running man, nice. After that days. night with Celieri's guys, I was back working as soon as I could. But it felt different. You get a lot of time with your thoughts when you're a cabbie, and other people's thoughts too. You there, driver? Yes, ma'am. Are you driving or loitering? Driving, ma'am. Always driving. Alright. So, where to? St. Michael's Church, directly. Careful, please. I always drive careful. Then you'd be the first. Alright, let's put a limit on. Turn that racket off. I can't hear myself think. There you go, happy. <laughs> what are you doing? You have to supposed to stop. So, church. It's Sunday already. Eyes on the road, please. Damn. She does have issues, I swear. Like, personally, I wouldn't like to be a, a taxi driver, but you know, it's a job. Like any other, you know what I'm saying, guys. And if you if you got issues with with a taxi driver, don't... Like, me personally, I would just sit down, like pull over somewhere and just like tell it to, you know, F off, right? She can find another taxi driver trying to be funky with me, man. I'll be fucked with you. Dude! These guys don't even know how to drive, I swear, man. Stop there. By the park. Okay. Here you go. St. Michael's. That'll be 30 cents. The only tip I'll give you is to stop smoking in your vehicle. I felt like I was sitting in an ashtray. Sure. 30 Whatever cents. You say. What is this? Is this what the what are you gonna get for 30 cents? Is there anyone from America around here? Let me know what you get for 30 cents around here. Can't drive without the radio. Better find a new fare. Uh, 
Uh, there's one on the left over here. I, can I mean, on the right over here. I can see. So let's have a look. Yep, I'm coming. Ooh. Art gallery. Give me there quick. Sure. Quick, oh, I can okay. do. Taking some time out. What's it to you? Not much. Just talking. I'm paying you to drive. So do that. Bro, are you trying to be okay? Look fine. Out there. The problem with this downturn is that it's made people lazy. Giving them an excuse. The work's not out there, pal. The work is always there. You just have to find it. I get it. You're a busy guy. I don't see so many these days. I saw this crapshoot depression coming. Sold up before the crash. So yeah, I get to be busy. Your busy day is gonna be looking at old paintings? I have a business meeting there with a colleague. Not that it's anything to do with you. If you ever find a real job, then maybe you'll understand. Until then, oh, drive and quit dude, bothering. Get out from my car, man. Yeah, yeah. I'm telling you I already. Why people are thinking that they are th like they are better than others, you know what I mean? Taxi drivers are like one of the most important people in the cities. Like without them, how would you get around? You know what I mean? Mm. Seriously, man. You'll be giving like big companies like flipping bus drivers, like bus drivers like you know, but it's mainly like a huge company, right? There's only like a bus company or whatever, right? You'll be giving them flipping your money. I wouldn't mind well, giving the taxi gallery. driver, but you know, I don't, I prefer to walk. I'm too, I'm, I'm too like, I mean, I'd say. Thanks, pal. There's 50 cents. Too greedy, my money. I'm broke. I'll try Still not. Still alive, guys. All right, get out, dude. You give me 50 cents, so now I earn 80 cents in... Every fair today's been good a son of a maybe? bitch. Under the, the next. Sorry, dude. Sorry, dude. Oh, my God. Who gives you a driving license, dude? Oh boy, you look like shit. I've been working since five. What's your excuse? Booze. Figures. Where are we going? Little Italy, 21st Street. Watch. Okay. Hey, if I don't tell the cops about the liquor on your breath, you don't tell them when I break the liquor. Good deal. Okay. Great deal. Got any good fares today? Yeah, some. But never enough of them. Today? Yeah, some. So guys, make sure you don't but hit anyone. never enough of them. Because then, we should fail. the money for cab rides since the market tanked and it all went to shit, I guess. Only reason I got you taking me places is I am drunk and don't know better. Can't see enough drunk fellas. They're only after the people moving it and selling it. Yeah, but I've seen them go after guys for less. Yes, so if they think they can shake something out of you, they will use any excuse. <clears throat> this city's corrupt as all hell. Sure is. Alright, so stuff like that I really don't like really because there. this guy's going to stop and the people are going to come out and you kill him. Like, piss me. Oh, wait, wait, shit, sorry. Piss me, I prefer if the trucks were like more hey, to the right. My cousin right has a coffee road, stand but, around the corner. What can I say? Tell him Lucy out sent you. Take a break. Huh? Alright, thanks. Thanks. Might just do that. Wait. Are you, are you paying me or what? He, he didn't pay! Dude, ah, uh, that's right, that's it. I'm done. I'm done. This guy didn't pay. I need, I need at least 30 cents. Hmm. Alright, let's see what's going on here. Whoa, Jesus! Shit. Hey, how you doing, pal? You remember me? No, I don't even yeah. know you. Whoa, crap. Leave my cab alone, man! 
Not Mr. Morello's a little Ooh. bit. Shouldn't go helping Salieri's goons, huh? I'm gonna have to give you a beating. Just so you always remember who runs this town. Make it so you won't do much rocking for a while. Eh? <laughs> Look at this guy. I didn't think he'd make it fun. Let's get him. Wait. Oh shit, these guys are shooting at me! What the hell? Why would you shoot at me? Like, I get it if you try to beat the crap out of me, but kill me? Okay, that's a, that's a little bit... That's too much. Shit! He's keeping you waiting, and you're waiting. And you're a woman for him. You could have gone through the roof, but I prefer to go down. Look at this. How you doing, kid? Dino, Lou! You got business with the Don? Nah, we just trying to talk to that cabbie over there, that's all. That right. Yeah. Well, this here's the Don's favorite driver. I like that guy. So anything you gotta say to him, you can say to me. Is that right? Well, I'll tell you something, pal. We ain't leaving empty-handed, that's for sure. Well, then maybe you ain't leaving at all. Okay then. See your boys around. Let's go, Lou. <laughs> Thanks. At least we could do. Come on, let's go say hi to the Don. Don Silieri? Yeah. He's gonna want to hear about this. Guys, guess I'm telling you, we're meeting the boss. All right, so what we have to do, we have, what we have to do, respect. I mean, this, guy, this guy's got money. This guy's got money, filthy money, man. Let's do it, let's get it. All right, uh, chapter completed, ready, man. Nice, let's go, let's carry on. Let's go for another one. Let's do this. Molotov party, mm -hmm. I swear, I thought that was the the other guy was the the boss. What do they call you, son? Thomas. Thomas Angelo, sir. Frank told me you ran into some trouble. Yes, sir. My cab got smashed up pretty good. Morello's thugs went after him. Are the kind of Tommy helping us? This uh, taxi. That's your livelihood. Yes, sir. I feel a sense of responsibility here. So I'm going to set you up with a small loan, enough to get that cab of yours fixed up. Well, I appreciate that, sir, but I'm not looking for a handout. Then what are we doing here? I just want a shot at the bastards who wrecked my cab. <laughs> you hear that, Frank? The kid wants my permission to get into a fight. Yes, I heard. Okay, Tommy Angelo. All the Morellas girls hang out at a bar he owns. Paul, you know the place. Sure do, boss. Good. You can ride along with Tommy. There's a lot right next to the bar where they park their cars. So smash up a few tin cans, send Morello a message. He can't rough up hard-working Joes in my neighborhood without getting a black eye. Thank you, Mr. Salieri. I won't let you down. And Tommy, when you get back, we'll talk about what's next for you. No one else knows you here, so tread careful, okay? Sure. The boss All right. Yet? Nah, you got more turns to sit on your ass. 
What is this? Uh, read note. Uh, okay. Right. Seems Ruben, like that's like anything some... good. Yeah, I. We're helping him out. I'm watching you. He's gonna drive you off. I get it. Got some kind of problem. Don't lose your job that easy. No. I hate Sorry, mate. Around. Born as hell. Okay. There you go, guys. If you want to read it, feel free. Just pause it. Damn, illegal for selling alcohol. Nice. Ooh. Oh, family history. There you go, guys. Where else can we find? Come back later. Can I... We're calling or send. The bars are closed. Got baseball Bobby behind you. Nice. Like I'm it. afraid. Well, maybe we can see something else around here. Anyways, I got places to be. Okay, come through this way. I'll take you to Vinny first. He's a loud mouth. I got places to be, people to beat. What's hey, that actually kind of right. We'll go see him whenever we need to do any uh, heavy lifting. We make sure we're well healed for when there's trouble. So we're grateful for his dough. We gotta go. Long drive back north. Right, so personally, the controls, the graphics are alright. I like it. They did quite change quite a lot. I did not play the first Mafia if uh, that's what you guys are going to ask. No, I did not, so I don't really know about the storyline as much. Just played the last one though. Oh, she's gonna sing! <laughs> Who's this then? Benny. This here's Tommy Angelou. We're doing a little job together. All right, good, good. Hey. You just need bean shooters or rods? Nah, we just need something to write off a few cars. Huh. Oh, I got just the thing. This classic should do the trick. <laughs> <laughs> if the bat don't work out for use, I got a few cocktails here. Ay, ay, ay. Careful with them, though. Don't want to burn off your short ears. <laughs> Good to meet you, Tom. Nice. Let me know if Paulie gives you the hard time. I'll straighten him out. Can I go past me? I'm seeing something here. Come back and see me Ooh. The boys don't scare you away. Detective. Ooh. Club fiction. Again. Okay. Another trophy, guys. I do do trophy hunting, guys. If you guys are uh, aware. On the end of the, uh, the main it's campaign, I am going to be doing live stream of this game. Of cars. I don't uh, for like trophy hunting. Stuff. I'm telling you, it's like some kind of black magic. All right, let's go talk to Ralph. Hey, genius! <laughs> Get your head out of your ass! <laughs> what the fuck, dear Polly? You can't, 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 can't just sneak up on a guy like that. Uh, I'm sorry, Ralph. I'm just busting your balls. <laughs> See, see, you're still a little limping. Guess we got two, 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 two cripples working here. <laughs> <laughs> you got that, Ralph? Just, sure. I just oh, got yeah. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. Good to meet you. Like I said, Ralphie here is a crack deck. Well, you bring him a stolen car, I'll make it yours. Tom and me, we got a job to do. We need some wheels. How about this one, Papa Polly? It, it, it ain't a ha 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 rod, but it, it'll get you across to, to, to town. All right, let's go. You're driving. And don't let me catch you loafing off again. <laughs> one day I'm gonna cut your brake line, asshole. I don't know what Ralph's trying to that? pull, giving us this motor. I want to show you something about the good life, and you're driving something my mom could have bought 20 years ago. If I know Ralph, he probably got it taken Dude. out of her yard. Cookie, yeah, you're guy's flipping driving It's nice good to get a change good from the stuff. kid. You don't have to be nice about it. Spins well, a dead uh, yeah, cat! Uh, so, 
Is that whiskey back there in the truck? Yep. New supplier. You guys deal in broad daylight? Normally, nah. This was their first drop-off. The cops know better than to come sniffing around our turf. Morello, the guy whose cars you gonna torch? He's got more friends on the force than us. But we're okay. So long as we're careful. Keep an eye over our shoulder. Some of the Canadian whiskey that comes through? You want a bottle? Just ask. We keep some back for friends. Hey! I swear, I don't fucking get this Travis, man. Junker. How are they supposed to, like, uh, literally, no I'm the drinker. one that are on the main road and you're turning into an alley? Most days, but not so much now. You have to give way. That stuff's no good for you. All the time. You don't have to go blind now, though. To us, you got a line in the good stuff. But it's good of you. Thanks. Not just the booze we supply, Tom. It's the places we deliver to. The dames they got in these places. Best tables, best food, best skirt. Some way to live. Right now, all I want to do is wreck the day of the bastards who wrecked mine. Sure, sure. Besides, all this could get a guy in trouble. Trouble says the guy is about to send fire to Morello's parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> I got you to protect me. It'll go fine. Well, if it don't go fine, try not to let him see your face. Either that, or you hit him so hard they don't remember it. This car can go only 40 miles per hour. We're getting on to Morello's turf now. There's some kind of line between his streets and Celieri's streets. Not really. There's always some give and some take. Though in general, we look after Little Italy and his guys work North Park. And more besides. You're walking on the wrong sidewalk, in the wrong part of town, you start getting a sense you need to be someplace else. You can feel it long before they start appearing on street corners to stare you down. Interesting. Thanks for letting me know about that. Next tip. Okay, it's close by. Goons smoke and jaw up front and leave their motors out back. There's some lazy bastards. They put some gorilla on guard duty, but it's always some no name schmuck. Come on, over here. We gotta sneak in and wreck the cars. And a message. Sure. Why are you coming with? To see if you get shot. <laughs> okay. Okay. You know you've. You know how to go quiet, right? Yeah, like that. Yeah, he's got his main guys. You'll get there someday. No one sees our heads. No one tries to pop them. Yeah, oh, crap, I forgot his triangle. I'll go keep their chunk busy while you creep up and jump them from behind. We don't get it distracted. Guys in the city real pissed. Actually, careful. Once I get the money, ah, uh, he's good for it. Hey, what the hell you doing? What do you mean, what am I doing? I mean, what I say. What the hell are you doing back there? Who are you? A guy who don't know what idiot told you to keep looking out here. Dino. Dino told me. Dino. Salieri's got guys all over town trying to give Morello a black eye. And he was like that. Got it. Can I have a tomato, but pick up. Wait, why would I pick a body? Now let's get. Drop the crap. Take your bat and start swinging. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's great. <clears throat> No one's driving that again. Oh, crap. Hey, get away from the car. Back up there, Tom. You got some kind of death oh. wish. 
Jesus. Like that. Oh. Nice. There's gonna be more of them. Use a Molotov and let's see some. Burning paintwork. Shit, we flew off. Whole block. We gotta go. We can take Dino's car. How'd you know this is Dino's car? I don't like you, and you got a good car. I'm gonna know where you. Reports of burning vehicles and gunfire in North Park. And we can take Drop it. that body. It's right near Morello's place. Don't bring in Let's the take. wrong people. It's like, oh, nice. Old ways are the best ways. It's very hard when you always. Straight through the gate. You're always we like, gotta get out of here before the bulls show. I clipped them. Don't the let them get away. Come Run, back, you bastards. We got oh shit. We got cops. So uh, what do we do? We lose them by driving real fast and getting clear of them. Sounds good. Right now they're pissed. Easy. But let's not get them real pissed. How about that call? Alright, how long do I have to wait till he like disappears? Is that a time? Right? Alright, we got this man. Alright now there you go. It's starting to disappear. Decent baby. All officers, search is called off. Repeat of We're good. Search. Let's head back and see the boss. I thought Silieri had cops on the books. Some street cops, sure. But Morello's got the chief in his pocket. How'd it feel? Feel good? How'd what feel? Yeah. Taking out the guy. Taking the shit out of him? Taking Dino's car. Feel good? Yeah. I guess it did. No time like the first time, Tom. Don't get better. You think it's for you? This life? What's it to you? Hey, I'm just asking questions. I like asking questions. I doubt that every day you and Sam go and panel beat motors in parking lots. Eh. In busy days, there's slow days. Try careful. We don't need the attention. Sorry. Eh. That was my bad. Busy days, going and slow days. Fun. Had more of an introduction than I ever got. You never got to beat up Dino's pals and take his motor? Nah, stole enough cars to get noticed, I guess. When I got squeezed by the cops, knew never to squeal. And one day I found myself in a yard behind a bar drawn with Vincenzo. Ten years go by and I'm still there. So, I got a suit now, and Vinny's an old bastard. <laughs> I always thought that to be in a family, you had to have... Nice. Super science stories. One out of 20. Okay. Do we have anything else around here that I can pick up? Oh, wait, wait. Very nice. Me and mom. Okay. Anything else around here, baby? Nope. Get out from here. Dude, you know you can't stand just... There you go. Get into a car. Wait, why do I have to get into a car? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh I my god. That to be in a family, you had to have more... Connections. Your brother. Or your uncle, or... Oh, some guys, sure. Your cousin got made, or you like Carlo, whose pop went way back with the Don. That means you get trusted more when you're starting out. There's plenty of us who came in off the street. Well, what happened to the c car I sent you out with? Dumped it. It's gone. Well, why? It was a boiler. This one's better. A, a better car with a, a broken window? Fresh air never killed nobody. <laughs> oh man. He 
he's still with you then. Somehow, yeah. Hey, boss. It's done. No trouble? Yeah, nothing we couldn't handle, Mr. Salieri. Good, good. Sit down. You see Morello? Nah. But he'll be plenty pissed when his boys tell him what happened. <laughs> He's not going to be able to think straight for weeks. See, that's the difference between me and Morello. I'm a businessman. I do everything with this. Every decision I make, it's what's good for the business and my boys. But Morella is a hothead. And all that anger burns out the brain. And when he gets mad, he gets stupid. You got nothing like that to worry about with Tommy here. He was aces the whole way, boss. I'm glad to hear it. I got a growing business here. We could use a guy like you to help out around the bar. Maybe run some errands. Make sure the bills get paid on time. You up for that? Oh, it'd be an honor, sir. Good. Good. Now, Polly and Sam have already vouched for you. But you need to understand we have a few rules around here, so you listen and listen good. First, no cursing on the premises. There's a million words out there. And the man who needs to resort to fuck this and fuck that is just ignorant or lazy. Second, we don't deal in the hard stuff. I don't want any dope fiends in this neighborhood. We'll let Morella poison his own people if that's what he wants. Finally, stay out of trouble with the cops. We only have a few on the payroll. And if you cross the line, the rest will come after you. You understand? Yes, Mr. Salieri. Then I'm gonna only ask you for one more thing, Tommy. I don't keep Paulie and Sam around just because they're strong. There's a lot of guys out there bigger and tougher than these two. And I don't keep Frank on apparel because he's smart. Though he is an artist with the numbers. All these guys in this room, they're here because they have the only thing that matters to me. The only thing that should matter to any of us. You know what that is, Tommy? They're loyal. That's right. Now, you stay straight with me, you're gonna be living the high life, Tom. But you abuse my trust. Don Salieri, you won't ever need to worry about me. Okay, then. Welcome to the family. Excellent. What I want to say, you know, Don't this start. is partially true. <clears throat> I've been watching some interviews about Let's some see. mafia people and everything that they... Welcome. Like families like that, they never sell drugs or stuff like that. I don't know about the swearing Come and all that Luigi. stuff, but much drugs, they, they stood, stood away from it. Sarah, Until like, I think it was like later on into like 1970s, I think. Some families decided to like sell cocaine or whatever. The way the city works. All right, so that's nice. Whew. I'm really enjoying this game, guys. I'm really enjoying it. It's a really good game. Uh, what do you guys think about it? If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and stay tuned. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to definitely see you on the next episode. I moved crates and delivered messages. The guys busted balls and told stories from the old country. Mostly, we just waited. I got to thinking, maybe life in Cillieri's crew wasn't going to get me clipped. <laughs> but what did I know? You, Tommy? Come on, there's still yeah. in your tank. Get Boss is waiting for you. Thanks. Right, like I was saying, thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you on the part two.